Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this video, we will see how to read the data from Google Spreadsheet and display it on OLED display. So let's get started. For this project, we will need a breadboard, ESP32 board, I2C based OLED display and few jumper wires. So let's do the connection. We will do the connection as per given in the table. So we'll connect SDA to the GPIO 21 and we'll connect SCL to GPIO 22. Ground will be connected to ground and VCC will be connected to 5 volt or VIN we can say. This project is divided into two parts. The first part is Google Spreadsheet coding and the configuration and second part is Arduino coding part. So let's start with the first part. So we'll create a new Google Spreadsheet. I already have created one spreadsheet. So I will open that one. Uh, go to the tools, script editor. Now the script is the way to access this spreadsheet for reading or for writing purpose. And when this application is deployed, then special callbacks functions like do get and do post are invoked whenever the request is made to the scripts URL. I already have created one example, so we'll be using this one. So whatever data we are sending from ESP32, so we'll get that data uh, in the do get function. So E is the parameter which will contain the data. So if you are requesting for reading, then we are reading the C2 cell from the spreadsheet. So whatever data we are updating in the C2 cell, uh, so that data will get transmitted to the ESP32. Uh, so whenever we are getting the request, we are reading the C2 cell and we are transmitting the data uh, to the ESP32. So after creating the example, we have to deploy the example. So click on deploy, new deployment. For the first time, you will get the configuration window like this. Click on this icon and now click on web app. Now change the access level to anyone and now click on deploy. Now we have to authorize the access to the Google spreadsheet. Select the email ID. Click on advance. Now click on go to the project and save. Click on allow and done. Uh, after this we will get the deployment ID which we will be using in the code. Copy the deployment ID. So we will paste that ID into the Arduino code. So in the Arduino code we have to paste the deployment ID here. Now our Google spreadsheet is ready. Now we will move to the Arduino coding part. So let's see what is there in the Arduino code. This is the library file for Wi-Fi connection. This is the library file for HTTP connection. These are the library files for, for OLED display. So here we have to change the data. Like here we have to change the SSID. Here we have to change the password. We have to paste the deployment ID here. So these parameters are defined for OLED display. This is the image we, which will be showing on the OLED display. Here we have taken one instance for Wi-Fi client. This function will update the data which we received from Google spreadsheet. So in the setup function, here we are setting the serial communication. We are setting the baud rate to 115200. So in this part, we are initializing the OLED display. Here we are initializing the Wi-Fi communication. And after that, we are printing some logs. So in the loop function, we are communicating with a spreadsheet. And here we have given some delay. So in the spreadsheet communication function, here we are forming the URL and here we are passing it to the HTTP client. So after making the request, we'll get the data in the payload uh, and we'll print the payload on the serial terminal. Let's compile the code and let's splash the code. And let's see the demo now. Now after flashing, we'll power on the board and we'll send the data from Google spreadsheet 
to the ESP32. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe to the channel for more videos.